Hey everybody, hope you're having a good day. Don't judge the background. This room is disorganized now. It was my candle room, but <laughs> uh, now I have my massage table and camera gear and all that stuff in there. But anyways, so today was a good day. Um, I made an 88 on my exam, but I got all the extra points, the extra credit points. So it brought me up to a 98. So I'm happy with it. I got a chance to give a wonderful massage to our medical program director. Um, she said she could tell that I was nervous when I was doing the interview process, which is the client intake part, where you ask questions and ask about medical history. And I, I knew that myself because when I was doing it, I literally like could not catch my breath. I couldn't breathe. <laughs> so I forgot to breathe. And I was already out of breath before I started my massage because I held my breath the whole time while I was asking her questions. So the good news though with that is she said once I jumped into the massage and started doing it, and as soon as I put my hands on her, like all the nervousness was gone, um, which I, I do feel that that is true. Um, I just kind of zoned out, zoned into the massage. And she said, other than the questions in the beginning, everything was on point. I was like in my jam. It was just, she had no complaints and she's like, as a client, absolutely loved it. So, um, really excited about that. Just wanted to do like a little quick debrief. Oh yeah, and another reason, really the main point of this reason too. So anyone who's trying to learn something, like I, you know, there's, I, I can't believe I'm actually learning and processing all this information that I am because we have to learn all the bones, the muscles and all that stuff. But, so we had to learn Okay, had to switch arms. Woo, talk about arm exercises. Like when you do massage all day, like by the end of the day, my arms are dead. Well, I don't do it all day, but still my arms are like dead because I've been exercising and so I've been doing push-ups, and then on top of doing massage five days a week. So um, anywho, I have a tip for you. So we had to remember the bones in the hands, the carpals that was on today's exam. 48 hours ago, I did not know those and I was sweating on how I'm gonna remember it all, but I made up a name for it and you can check me. So go online, look at the carpal bones of the hands. And so when you start, depending on if you're looking at your anterior posterior view, and I'm gonna start doing videos like this so you guys know like what I'm learning, what I'm talking about. This would be anterior, this is posterior, so back, front, this is your dorsal, this is your palmar. So many names for the same thing, but um, you going by the bones of depending on what you're looking at. Um, so there is the, let's say if I'm looking at the dorsal side where you're going to see the pisiform. So starting from the outside, working your way in. Now remember, I didn't know these 48 hours ago, so. But this is how I remember it. So scaphoid and lunate had a, scaphoid and lunate had a baby named Capitate, and trapezium and trapezoid are distant cousins from triquatrum, and pisiform always thought he was above hamate. <laughs> and so there you go. That is my learning style. That's how I'm able to absorb so much. And uh, I just, I figured out myself like, okay, this is how you are going to have to start learning things and sticking it a whole lot better. Um, because I've been making a lot of 80s in the 80 departments on my tests lately and I'm not liking it. I don't, I don't like that. Uh, when you're used to getting 90s and 100, I know I sound, you know, ridiculous to a lot of people, um, but that's just, you know, my little thing. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna try and work on that method because it's really working for me and see how it goes. So I'm going off to study and write my paper, do my resume, head out. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Um, and I'm looking forward to start making more of these videos because I'm just learning so much about massage in general. Um, and I really wanna share them with you guys. So, all right, I'll see you on the next post. Bye, hope you're having a great day.